Yeah, crucifixion in the time of the Romans, something they inherited, by the way, and perfected uh, from the Persians. Uh, crucifixion was a very brutal uh, way to die. The idea was uh, you were, there you were nailed to the cross, up, up in the air for everybody to see, and you didn't die right away. It wasn't like being beheaded or even hanged. Uh, you could hang uh, nails through your wrists or your wrists tied, nails through your feet, usually through the heels, having been severely beaten, and you just simply hung on that cross in agony and suffering until you eventually died. And outside of the land of Israel, people hanging on crosses might take a couple of days, two, three days before finally dying. Horrible way to go. Uh, in Israel, uh, of course, the bodies had to be taken down before nightfall. That was a Jewish law which Rome respected. And that would mean that the leg bones had to be broken so the person would just sag and hang down till the diaphragm collapsed and they suffocated. Horrible. Well, have we found evidence of this archaeologically? Yes, we have. Uh, an ossuary was recovered uh, about uh, 40, 40 some years ago. And in this bone box, that's what an ossuary is, and the name written John on it, or Yehohanan, inside were a couple of skeletons, and there was an iron spike still in the right heel of this individual. And by the way, his shin bones were shattered. So this is a Jewish man, obviously. He was crucified, they broke his legs, he died. His body was put in a tomb. They couldn't get the spike out of his right heel. The end of it had been bent over. It was like a fish hook. And so one year later, according to the Jewish custom, he's reburied, his, bo his bones are gathered up, taken to the family tomb. And then 19 centuries go by and we find him. And there he is with the spike still in his, and traces of wood too, by the way, still clinging to this rusty spike. فأخذوا يسوع ومضوا به فخرج وهو حامل صليبه إلى الموضع الذي يقال له موضع الجمجمة ويقال له بالعبرانية جلجثة حيث صلبوه وصلب اثنين آخرين معه عن يمينه وعن يساره ويسوع في الوسط 